Hi, I'm Amy Long with Red Carpet Report at the Saban Theater in Beverly Hills for the premiere of Nat Geo's Saints and Strangers. Okay. So tell me a little bit more on working with uh, Saints and Strangers uh, and a little bit more about your character as well. Yeah, sure. Uh, um, I play Habamak, uh, which is the war chief to uh, Masasuit in the Pekanakit tribe. Uh, he's, he becomes the military liaison between the tribe, uh, the Pekanakit people, the Wampanoag, and um, the settlers when they come in. So he, him and uh, Miles Standish uh, become good friends because they're both kind of the generals, uh, the war generals of, 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 of both uh, people. I do know that you did get to speak in a couple of different languages, even learn some of your relatives' native tongue, right? Right. Uh, we spoke uh, West, uh, Western Abeniki, okay. which is Eastern Algonquin, and it's a combination of uh, a, a few different tribes up in the uh, East Coast and the Northwest, and um, it's just a blend. And it's a, it's an awesome language. Uh, it has a rhythm a rhythm to it, very poetic, um, and it was great to to learn it. You know, yeah. Was there one word in particular that just rolled off your tongue that you're like, why do I keep saying this? Yeah, that's easy. It's Aquataha. Aquataha. That means war. <laughs> For some reason, that means war. Yeah. The war chief. I had a lot of Aquataha going on. So, yeah, yeah. That one sticks in there. Yeah, that one's going to stick for a while, I'm sure. Yeah. <laughs> so, I also know that you do a little bit of a comedy on the side. Yes. Oh, man. Sorry about that. Uh, Why are you sorry? <laughs> exactly. Ba boom. -sh. Do you got any good jokes for us? Or what are you working on? Uh, good jokes for you. Um, I travel all the time doing uh, stand-up comedy. Um, travel a lot to schools. I'm a drug-free, alcohol-free, uh, sober performer. Um, so I go to a lot of uh, schools and, and uh, just talk to young kids about uh, living a clean lifestyle. And, and uh, so a lot of high schools, a lot of colleges. So my comedy is it's all ages, you know. Even old people come. Like old elders come. Yeah. yeah. And almost everyone can speak in humor sense like they, everyone speaks that language hopefully definitely yeah everybody I mean uh, humor and laughter is universal we went to uh, chocolate Sunday at uh, the laugh factory the other night <laughs> and uh, we might have been the lightest people there but uh, it was awesome I mean, we were laughing the comics are getting and it was great it was a good night yeah. sure you picked up a lot of new material then too <laughs> I did I did just from being there it was awesome it was a fun night such a pleasure to meet you I'll try to catch one of those shows soon thank you <laughs> Thanks for watching. If you liked this interview, give me a big thumbs up. Subscribe for more videos and in the comment box below, tell me some of your Thanksgiving traditions. I like turkey and cranberry sauce and food. I eat three times. My tradition is I eat three times. Tis all.